Hi everyone, it's a beautiful day in the village. Ryan and I are going to get our Christmas tree, get our Christmas decorations, um, and so I thought I would take you with me today. Um, if you're new here, I'm Nina Davalori. This is The Complexion Diaries. I basically share my entire life um, and love giving advice along the way. So let's go. I just popped into Sephora to pick up my Black Friday order, the one thing that I ordered. And if you have not done like online and pick up in person, it's so convenient. Um, it's my first time actually doing it, but like it actually worked out really well. And this is the one thing that I bought. I'm very proud of myself, downsizing my beauty journey. So um, yay, okay. Every time I walk by Tao, I have so many thoughts. Like I remember moving here and we would like always come down and go to Tao. Like, 10 years ago, eight years ago, and it was like such a fun thing. And now I'm just like, oh, you know, those days were fun and I'm happy they're over and I just wanna go get my Christmas tree. I just passed my old apartment that I lived at for like three years. Um, it was on 17th and 7th, but Ryan also used to live in Chelsea, but our paths never crossed while we were both in this area. Although you were like further up. All right, we finally made it. We're gonna go to TJ Maxx and Marshalls to see what decorations they have, and go from there. You don't like candy cane. Wait, you might like this one. Would not expect Jessica Simpson to have a home thing. $25, do you think it's worth it? 25 seems like a lot. Wait, this is really cool, Ryan. The mug changes when it gets hot. $6? I mean, do I need this? I feel like I need this. I think I need this. Ryan made me put it back. He didn't make me, but he was right. He's like, do you really need this? I get really excited about these things. I think this one's nice. It's pretty, it has like the flocked white. We should get this one. It's $40. I like this wreath, but I think the snowman looks a little cheap. This is cute though. See the, the white one? It's like different, but I just don't think we have a place for it. What about this one? Six. Yeah. You're not into it? It's $20. I think it'll look nice on our door. It's different. It's festive, I'm gonna get it. There really wasn't a ton of stuff at Marshall's. We got like a couple things. Let's look at all the tchotchkes. Wait, like this is cute. This like big ornament ball, that Merry Christmas one. It's definitely like a couple different shades of Santa's. That's nice. It's progress. An advent calendar. Okay, we just got back and I'm gonna show you exactly what we bought. So first I got these two little stocking hangers. They were $15. We had two and we needed two more. So I thought those are really cute. We did end up getting the Christmas balls and also the um, red one to go. This one actually lights up. So I thought like these two next to each other would be really cute. And then we got some gift tags, like little Christmas holiday gift tags. We thought of some really cute gift ideas for our building. And so um, I showed you like the stuff that we got at the container store. So Ryan had a cute idea for that. And we thought we would put these little gift tags on it to make it look super cute and write a note. And then we got these holiday pillows. So I liked these because the red is obviously adds like the perfect pop of color since everything we have is white. And it also, we have pillow covers that are exactly this pillow size, so we can put them on during the year and then take them off for the holidays, which is perfect. And I'm hungry, so I'm gonna get a snack, and then we are gonna go venture out and get our Christmas tree, which I was like, we should just have this tree delivered. Ryan was adamant on picking it up himself, so we're gonna go do that. I'll be honest, this is my first tree excursion. In New York. In New York. No, it's my first tree excursion ever, so. I've had a real tree, but I've never like gone and picked out a tree. So, I've always had it delivered. yes, I've always had it delivered. You make me sound so snobby. He's, he's like giving me such a look right now. Um, okay, so yeah, I will. I, I'm gonna. I'm gonna vlog all of it because this should be an, an adventure. Okay, bye. We moved my little thinking chair from this corner. Ryan got this tree genie thing. I have no idea what a tree genie is, but he tells me it's the Rolls Royce of Christmas tree stands. They make it by hand. No, they don't. What are you on, Beans? We're gonna go get our first Christmas tree. First tree together. First tree together. Ever. Ever. I'm excited. 
The place we went to was so knowledgeable and the person helping us really explained to us the colors of the tree, whether that's silver, blue tint. I really wanted a traditional green tree and to watch him shake out and open it in front of us and like pick the one that felt like the perfect shape was so much fun. Yay, we got it. Bringing it home was so much easier than I thought it would be. I would say honestly, the one thing that we maybe spent a little too much time on was figuring out the water situation and how to fill the tree genie. <laughs> It's like a little buoy. A what? Like a buoy. It's just sitting on top of the water. We have like another inch to go. We're like two little <laughs> kids in like a science experiment. Beans, this is this is love. This is what this is this is this is what you want. I know, it is what I want. I'm very grateful. So stop? Yeah, so stop. It it was late to catch up, so there's a leaf in here. Do you think there's gonna be bugs in here? What are we gonna put on top of our tree? I don't know. What do you think we should put? We used to put a star, but I don't know if I really like a star that much. We used to put an angel, but... Oh yeah, we went through an angel phase too, but I don't know. This isn't really like a religious thing for us, so do we need an angel? It's the perfect shape too! Yeah, it was like exactly what I wanted. And I like the color. I like that it's full. I'm doing like a little holiday movie night with some of my friends, so I feel like this will at least be a little festive to have out. It is perfect for the windowsill. It's always the hard part is like shaping them. It's like my seamstress once told me, you have to be firm but gentle with like zippers. I feel like Christmas ornaments are the same way. It's like holiday decorating and hostess advice with Nina. I feel like is part of this episode. Like, I feel like there used to be like etiquette guides. I don't know. I'm here for it. Just be firm but gentle with your holiday guests. Do we have batteries? Yeah. Really? What, what kind? Double A? Yeah. Oh, you're the best. I will never forget it. I like this lampshade and it's festive. I found our tree topper. What is it? Look. No, oh my God, beans. Yeah, they look really pretty. Good find, honey. Ryan has good ideas. Costco. Costco. <laughs> Does it look nice? Hmm? Yeah. It looks so pretty. I know. I love you. Okay, I think I'm gonna end this vlog here because it's gotten so long already, but I'll show you the um, close up of the little Christmas village. I think it's so cute. These little reindeer are from Costco and the little houses are from Costco as well. Thousands of other people have the same village. <laughs> Thousands of other people might have the same village, but everyone I'm makes it differently. Okay, thanks so much for following along. We're gonna decorate the whole tree tomorrow and I'll do a separate video of like just that part. Um, but please like, subscribe, share, comment. Um, it honestly really does help build the community that I hope that we can build here. And I hope you enjoyed this little peek into our first Christmas. I'm so excited and uh, this was so fun for me to share with all of you. So thanks for watching and I will see you tomorrow decorating this whole tree. Bye. Say bye.